Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. This is Adana, also known as the FOC. Today I'm reading for the collective. Hey, collective. Flowers, flowers, flowers. <laughs> Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell uh, to book a private reading with me or shop in my store. All that information is in the description box below. All right, let's get into it. All right, guess I'll take those letters that are on the floor. So something. All right, let's see. Let's see first. Let's see. <laughs> no, 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 bruh. I'm gonna show you the letters. This is fucking crazy. Nah. Bruh. <laughs> mm. Okay, I'm I'm gonna read into it. That's fucking crazy. This this two plus one plus one is four. Somebody here we go. Somebody playing with that that you know playing with the playing with um energy. Two plus one plus one. It's five, a four. Four is spiritual and mundane, spiritual and physical manifestations. So someone was doing death spells here. Somebody could be praying through another language or another, so Eid. Someone is asking for prayers within the different background. Or someone from a different background. Eid, so Arabic is praying for this person. This is going to be a hard read. Mm, I have to do it. We have miracles in reverse. Damn. We have connect in reverse. That's, that's, that's not good. That's not good. Um, yeah. This is because of the death spells that they were doing here. Candle work. Energy. They were pushing death spells on you. And they were very relentless on top of you. But there's someone of the Eid background, or I don't want to say it wrong because I'm not trying to. Arabic or Muslim, just correct me, please. But you get my drift. And I know Eid is with Middle Eastern. Yep. They're asking the community to pray for them. So it's like they, okay. So I'm hearing this person may have initially started off with the Quran, the Arabic backgrounds, the community here. Then they came to spirituality, but they abuse spirituality. They didn't believe in it, but they just saw it. They saw it as a, as a as a reason to use it to get ahead or to manipulate others to get ahead now now they're realizing that this is not working in their favor because they came they came with negative intentions or they didn't have good intentions to begin with when stepping into the arena of spirituality and they were using it in a very foul and very negative way 
And now, I mean, this person was doing death spells here. They, they, wow, that took, now they're asking for help from others. And it could be the community here, this community here, because I'm hearing origin. So this person may have started off from this background, from this origin. This could be in their family dynamics here. And yeah, they're asking for family or friends or however, whoever to pray for them in Arabic. Now, I don't know anything about Arabic. I do not. And I'm not going to say, oh, yeah, girl. I don't know nothing about anything. All I know is that I am the messenger. I'm just going to just whatever messages I receive. That I that I get the green light from the universe to 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 disseminate is what I'm going to do, and even though these individuals, family members, friends, take high resonate are praying very hard over this person, it won't be granted. And let me tell you why it will not be granted. Because this person left one dynamic to come to another, but their intentions weren't good. Their intentions weren't pure. Now, everyone's background is different. So I only know what I know. What I do daily is with my spiritual, however. And coming from one, one background to another here, but you're using, you're using the background that you came for for good, right? You're using all that for good. This karmic is using the Arabic, the Quran for great. For good but it got wind somehow of the spiritual world and they wanted to start to play with the darker aspects of it but didn't know there were severe repercussions to playing with darker energies that you don't know nothing about so yes this person we're doing death spells on you we have connects and we have miracles in reverse because they're realizing that they can no longer connect or they don't have a connection to the divine. They're realizing the miracles that they were receiving was very negative because it was using, it was working with energies to destroy people, to topple over people, to stop people from moving forward or do whatever it is that they need to do for themselves. They were literally trying to hinder people with spell work, but in an, in an adverse way. That's just that person. Now that person is realizing that shit is really hitting the fan because they met up on someone that know exactly what they're doing. They can't handle it. So now they're calling in reinforcements from another religion, their previous or prior religion, to help them get out of this situation or this right here, the community. So there's a community of individuals with this Eid background or Arabic or Middle Eastern background here that are actively praying for this person. Well, I'm here to tell y'all that it's denied. You don't get to do well or love on one type of system to come to another one, to only use that one specifically spirituality in a very negative and adverse way. And now shit not work in the way that you anticipated for it to work, karmic. Now you want to leave it. And now you want to condemn it and say it's negative. You want to go back to where you, no, 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 no. Mm -mm. It would have been fine that, okay, you left one system to come to another, or whatever, however way y'all look at it, method or whatever, child, perspective, however. It would have been cool if you left one perspective to gain insights or more positive insights or resources into the new belief or system or whatever, however, take it how it resonates. No, you want to leave where you were to come over here to muddy, to desecrate spirituality and then go back. Oh yeah, I told you. Nah, that ain't happening. That's why the divine is making a huge example out of you. That's what's being revealed. A mother is involved in this. This here gonna be long. 
controversial. I, I, that's why when I saw them letters, I was like, nah, come on, y'all. On this good Friday. But everything can't be just glitter and gold and glitter and unicorns because that's just not the way the world works. But there's someone, and I'm going to be as respectful and I'm going to be as as I can, because this is a very serious matter here. There's someone, there is a mother that has, that comes from an Arabic background, okay, that is dabbling into spirituality. But they're dabbling into spirituality in a negative way. This is a mother, moon is mother energy. Not only that, it's being revealed. This may have taken place on a Monday. Because Monday is also moon day. Monday, uh, moon also represents emotions, hidden emotions. And this mother energy here had a lot of animosity towards you. This ain't going to resonate for everybody. Just take what resonates, be the rest. Please don't tell this don't resonate with me that I'm not speaking to you. Please save me from that because that's irritating. Then it's, it don't resonate with me. Then, okay, that's fine. Then that means this reading is not for you. Stop placing yourself in a place that you don't belong. Like if something don't resonate with me, because I listen to other readers too, I skip right over it. I don't make a sound. I don't make a, oh, okay, yo. Oh, no. All right, no. Ooh, and I go to the next next read it, reading of the of the uh, the person, and if two or three don't resonate, all right, then this person don't resonate with me. I don't get on here and oh, I did this. Don't stop doing it. It's it's irritating. Stop, please. It's really irritating. If it don't resonate, that's fine. I promise you, I'm not gonna lose no sleep. I promise you. You don't have to keep bringing it up to everybody's attention. This don't resonate. Okay, move forward. Go find something that do resonate. Anywho, I mean to get off path here, but that can also be symbolic as well, too. Like somebody wants something to stick so bad, like they're willing to do anything to make it stick. Now it's starting to stick. And like I keep telling you guys, be very careful of placing yourself in situations that don't resonate or don't stick with you. Because over time, you're telling the universe by agreeing, disagreeing is a form of agreement as well, too. Yeah, it's just a negative part or aspect of things. Get into the habit of learning that this world is was created based on duality. A good side, a bad side, a dark, a light, a left, a right, up, down. I can keep going on and on and on. Polarity, okay? Reciprocity. Learn the, learn the laws. Learn the universal laws, please. Maybe I'll come on here and explain that deeply or break it down intricately because I'll, I'll just be like, whoa. Anywho, I'm not against Sasha. Anywho, so we have mushrooms here. So family dynamic, family, whatever, friends, however, whatever, um, is aware that this this mother is, they, they come, they have, they have Arabic background or Muslim background here. But yet they're coming to spirituality and they're using it for negative. And I got a huge issue with that. I would never, ever go to someone's point of view or belief system and, and, and desecrate it or destroy it or speak negative or ill. I would never do that because that's, you know, that's their, that's the way they believe. That's the way they, and I can respect that. Why is the spirituality is the only, and it's not a religion, but I'll say belief or system here. I don't even want to say a system because I don't want to get too deep. Anywho, y'all, hopefully y'all catch my drift. Why is spirituality the only one that's being condemned for being so negative? But every other religion out there is, is, is highly, oh, it's this and it's that. That's not cool. And I got an issue with that. Everybody got their own whatever they believe in. And I'm cool with that. So if I could be cool and everybody got their own thing, why y'all can't be cool with spirituality guy? It's always in the, the ones that always using it for negativity, for trash. And then realize the oh, oldest shit is really truly what it is. It's real. Then you want to go and you want to you want to smear the the thing that you came to to you came in with no good intentions to begin with. I got an issue with that.
because this person's hiding behind another they're hiding behind a religion here to spite others to hurt and to harm others and then when everything's said and done they go back and behind that's not cool you can't do that that's not cool that ain't cool at all but this here this person has an e background it came from a background of muslim arabic quran energy it came from this energy here and there's a group of people that are currently praying for this individual right now. And I'm telling you respectfully, nicely, however way you want to slice it, dice it. Them prayers not them prayers not gonna get uh they're not gonna get granted at all. They're not gonna get granted here because this person left over there to come to spirituality to cause harm to someone, to someone that didn't do anything to them. That's why them letters came out like that. And before I could see the letters that came out, I said, something is on the ground. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Justice. And that's coming straight from the divine, boo. From the universe. We got health in reverse. Somebody real sick right now. You can't do that. You can't hide behind one and then come to another one to cause havoc and, 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 and mayhem. And then after you do that, you go back to, no, to, to feel like you're safe. No, 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 mm -mm. nope. It's what you did. You left one, one system, one belief to come to another to, to, no, no, can't do that. And then you hid behind the scenes like no one going to see you. And thinking that's funny it's not funny <laughs> to the collective maybe but to you karmic this ain't funny you thought it was though like i said i don't know the traditions i don't know the backgrounds of you know uh studying the quran or the arabic prayers and things like that i'm not versing that so i'm not gonna be here no i'm not but from my standpoint spiritually you gotta take this karma boo you gotta eat this karma you gotta eat that bruh you gotta eat that joint you gotta eat that you can't go you left one to come to another to, and then hide nah uh-uh no mm -mm, no uh -huh. nope can't do it boo can't do it they literally was doing death spells, bruh. They literally was doing death spells. Well, who do? Who do work? Hmm. And they really thought that they would never got caught. Because now they're going back to their origin, to what they grew up with, which is the Arabic background here. And they realized their life still fucked up. And what's the, 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 the crazy part here? Is that the people that are praying? Y'all, that, that's see. The people that are praying for them too, their life's starting to fall apart. It, stop playing with spirituality, thinking this shit is a game or a joke. It ain't a. It ain't a game. It ain't a joke. And it deserves the respect that it that it that it it it, it needs. Y'all sitting here and y'all get. Look at this card that came up. Tread lightly. Tread lightly. Possible heated argument. I said this can be con this can be considered controversial. But that ain't cool. They got people praying for them. They don't know why exactly fully to the extent as to why they're praying for them. They just see, oh, such and such sister, something, a brother, something is in trouble. We need to pray. And you, <sighs> I'm telling man, the people that are praying for them are going to experience the hardship that they try to incur on you, collective. cannot blame spirituality you gotta blame the person 
the practitioner. The practitioner is an individual who practices or does it. The person who did it. And you have to blame this mother-like energy for this here because she did this. Now she's asking for prayers from another group or system or belief here. And they want to start to feel that, that there. Oh, messy. <sighs> Careless, reckless, overwhelmed, sad, in other people's shadows. That's not going to end well. And the first thing they're going to want to do is blame spirituality. But yet, spirituality is not the reason, man. <sighs> Just sit there and watch. When I say these, oh, Lord, oh. <laughs> I don't get it. I don't get it at all. They doing death spells on you. Using spiritual, spirituality. But they won't, they would not do that. With their 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 initial belief system. They wouldn't do that. But they come to spirit, they come to the spiritual world and they want to make sure and use it in a verse way. This tells me this is not this per this person accustomed doing this, but it came up on the right one. That don't make sense. You're using good for one, but you come over here, you want to use it for bad. And now when bad is happening, you're blaming it. You're blaming spirituality, but yet you're using it for bad. Hmm. Overwhelmed, blocked, jealous. Let me tell you something. The, the original, so where they came from, their, their original belief or their system here, telling you things are going to start to fall apart in their life here. And that's something that they don't, they do not. Don't play. And when they find out truthfully, because they're going to find out truthfully, this mother energy here, they're going to run that out. They're going to run it out. Ooh. Pay attention. Hmm. Mm, mm, mm. It's already happening. Or it's already happened. of the Arabic community they may not believe and that's fine but don't disrespect spirituality just like don't disrespect the Arabic community you know what I mean everybody's different I think this is dying so let me stop Ugh. that's my first time seeing it like that so let's see. I'll vote. I hope all this was recorded. <laughs> South Node, third house, Aquarius. Gemini, ninth house, uh, Venus. Pluto, eighth house, eighth, Gemini. All right, so you're dealing with a Libra, Virgo, Capricorn, Aquarius, Aries, Taurus, two more, Sag, Gemini. All right, so if that resonates, please like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Mm.